Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can set up the new iPhone 13, 13 Pro, the 13 mini or the 13 uh, Pro Max and uh, how you can transfer the data over from an older iPhone. Now, before we begin, make sure both device is fully charged and then on your new iPhone 13, press on the power button or on the side button press and hold for a few seconds and the phone will turn on also make sure that you have inserted your network carrier sim card okay once it's turned on on this phone here you can see it automatically pops up as set up new iphone so on the older iphone tap on continued and now we need to place the old iphone over the new iphone with this circle Okay, we will need to put in the passcode of the old iPhone. So I'm going to put in the passcode. And now it says set up your iPhone and we can do this wirelessly. We don't, we don't need to use any cable. So say so while doing this, make sure that the two devices are close to each other. Yeah, so it may take a few minutes to activate the iPhone. Okay, so still um, waiting. Okay, next on the next uh, screen, it's asking for face ID. iPhone can recognize the unique three dimensional features of your face to you unlock. So I'm going to tap on continued. And in here you can set up face ID or you can choose to uh, set up later. That's uh, totally up to you. So I'm going to choose set up later. Okay, so it says transfer data from the older iPhone. So we're going to tap on continue. There's also other options that you can choose. And because you want to transfer the data over, I'm going to choose continue. So setting up your Apple ID. Okay, on the next screen, we're going to tap on the agree button to the terms and condition. Okay, on the next screen, it says make this your new iPhone. And here's everything set up as you had it on your other iPhone. So we've got apps and data, uh, settings. It'll bring the settings over. And then tap on continued. Next, you can set up Apple Pay, or you can do it later. I'm going to choose set up later in wallet. And then you can choose to share audio recordings or not. I'm going to choose not now. And now in this, at this stage, it's going to transfer the data over from an old iPhone over to the new iPhone. And uh, depending on how much data you have to transfer over, sometimes it can take a while, half an hour to an hour, uh, because I do not have a lot of data on the old iPhone. That's why you can see here, it says only a minute. Okay, it's nearly finished now. So it's a transferring data. And on a new iPhone 13, it has just restarted. Okay, so now I'm going to sign in and that's it. So now we have uh, successfully um, transferred the data over on my iPhone, on my old iPhone. It's still saying transferring data. So it could be a bug or something because this one has already finished. 
uh, setting up but over here it still say uh, transfer data okay now so after I have logged into the home screen a message comes up so I'm just going to tap I'm just going to tap on yes your Apple ID and phone number are now being used for iMessage and FaceTime so I'm going to choose OK so I'm going to wait and let this finish so do not press on the cancel yet just uh, wait for a bit and let it finish so it has been saying about one minute for a while now it's definitely over a minute and just try to wait and see what happens so you can see on my other screen the apps are still loading so it's still downloading onto the new iPhone 13 now the phone is automatically connect to a Wi-Fi network so I did not have to manually put in the Wi-Fi password it's automatically retrieved from an old iPhone so many other settings also get transferred over to the new iPhone as well as your iCloud ID, uh, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, cellular settings everything is brought over from the old iPhone automatically as well so you do not have to manually put in anything so perhaps the reason this is still showing transferring data is because uh, the apps over here are still installing okay it seems this one is just kind of like stuck here for a while on my iPhone 13 everything seems to be transferred over already uh, if this happen if this happens to you uh, you want to make sure that uh, all your data has completely transferred over such as photos uh, your email setup your contacts and documents and apps so if everything seems to be working correctly everything is already transferred over you can restart your iPhone uh, your old iPhone so this one here I'm just going to cancel it seems like it's, it's kind of stuck or something so I'm just going to stop the transfer and yeah that's how you can uh, transfer or how you can set up the iPhone 13 series and transfer data over for an older iPhone now if everything's failed if, it, if it's failed uh, what you can do is you can go into settings and then go down to general and swipe down and tap on transfer or reset iPhone and you need to erase all contents and settings and you will need to start again so if something happens and it's not working as you expected just simply erase this iPhone and then start the setup process again and that's it thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more videos